Yeah. Yes. Thank you so much. Terima kasih banyak. Sampai jumpa. Sampai jumpa. Me and my mustache are all alone. Hello. Hello. Irlandia. Irlandia, German. Berapa harga? Berapa harga? Great to be able to freely roam a beautiful and historic city like Jakarta. Ketchup is not ketchup. It's soy sauce. Selamat datang dan salam. Welcome to Jakarta. Indonesia, a massive bustling metropolis with around 30 million people living in it. This is our very first time in Jakarta. It's also our very first time in Indonesia. And today we're going to be exploring Jakarta for the very first time and bringing you guys along with us. So we're ready for some new food, some new experiences, and to meet some new amazing local people. Let's check out Jakarta. So today is our very very first day of exploring in and around Jakarta and right now we are in the Kota Tua area which is considered the old town of um, Jakarta so like the original downtown if you will and uh, right now we are in the Chinatown market space of Kota Tua and uh, we came here sort of to um, understand maybe Jakarta and the old town a little bit better before diving into the newer parts and wow this is absolutely amazing, very, very interesting um, for a very first day of exploring. So much going on everywhere, uh, a lot of people, a lot of scooters, a lot of vegetables for sale and so on. It's very, very nice to actually walk around here. It's uh, very beautiful and uh, definitely a very good step to uh, step towards the culture of Indonesia or of Java um, a little bit more today, I want to say. A city that has over 30 million people, I'll tell you what, you are bound to find some really good food, some really good people and a plenty of culture as well. And that's the whole reason why we are traveling. And if you guys are new here, I'm sure plenty of you guys are going to be new to the channel. My name is Luke and this is Hello. Naomi. Hello. And we have been traveling the world now for around two years. I'm Irish, Naomi is German. And uh, yeah, we find joy in doing this. We find pleasure in traveling the world, meeting amazing people and trying amazing food and just blending in with local life. And uh, yeah, that's exactly what we're going to do. We made our way through the area of Glodok or Chinatown and uh, we're trying to make our way in and around the market area and we might as well bring you guys and show you around it uh, is pretty it's pretty hectic yeah. it is pretty crazy there's a lot going on we're going to make our way into sort of the inner workings of Kota Tua the old town of Jakarta I feel like it's the perfect place to begin this journey I feel like it's very very hectic and busy today because it's Saturday early afternoon so everybody and their grandma is out on the streets doing their shopping for the weekend getting ready to sort out those family dinners so I think uh, today is going to be crazy Kuching, <laughs> 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 one of the little words I know in Indonesian. Kuching, <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, look at all the kuchings. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, so many kuchings. So many kuchings, yeah. <laughs> it's a little snug here. Hello. 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 <laughs> Wow, it's packed. Very busy. We found ourselves literally inside a tunnel universe of a market. Yeah, I feel like I feel like this market area was not built for us. We're a little bit big. We're a little bit on the bigger side of yeah. life, yeah. Westerners, we're all very fat. These look very interesting. Wow. I'm not sure Is what it, they are. I think they're sweet buns, like Tell us sweet no. bean. Let us know, guys. Hello. Let us know down in the comments, guys, exactly what they are, so we can give them a try. Hello. Hello. Oh, look at this. Yeah, very interesting actually. Yeah, this is a prawn pancake. Oh, this is like a like a vada, like a like a pancake, prawn pancake. Very cool. He's making a like cake. Some sort of a fried cake. There's another cat. Another cooching. So many cats around here. But uh Kuching, uh putty, white cat. Ooh. <laughs> showing, yeah, this is here, kuching, showing our uh, expertise. Kuching hitam, then hitam. putty, uh, black and white. <laughs> <laughs> I know all about the cats. <laughs> 
That's the only thing I know so far. <laughs> Another thing that you're absolutely guaranteed to get if you're in a city with around 30 million people is some pretty crazy traffic. We've been trying to cross this road now for a solid 10 minutes or so. So let's see if we can get across. I'm kind of trying to wait for some locals to cross and just attach ourselves. Oh, no, 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 come. Stop, stop, stop. Oh God, okay. <laughs> I was waiting for some locals, but I saw I saw a gap in the traffic, so we had to walk. I'm very sorry. <laughs> it's very risky this way. Don't do it this way. Risky business. This intersection here is pretty crazy. Oh, Naomi left me behind. Let's see if we can make it. Oh, we, we made, made it. it. <laughs> wow. It's like adrenaline. Yeah. Wow. Hello. Hello. Oh, look at all these hats. Wow. Oh, we're walking um, towards like a little bit inside of Kota Tua. There is like a history museum and so on and we just wanted to see it at least from the outside. Um, yeah, let's kind of see what this area has to offer. Right here guys you have the Mandiri Museum. It seems to be an old Dutch factory. Now the Dutch were colonizing Indonesia for the longest period of time I believe roughly around 300 years or so of colonization in Indonesia which is very interesting and I'm sure left a very big mark on the country. Uh, air? Air dua? Air dua. 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 Uh, three bucks, I don't know. Irlandia. <laughs> Irlandia, <laughs> German. You Jakarta? Nice. It's beautiful. Nice yeah. to meet you. Yeah, have a nice day. Oh, thank, you. thank you. You wanna Such grab a, nice a water? Guy. Yeah, I'll grab one. Was he from Jakarta? Sorry, I didn't hear the conversation. The guy in the horse cart, yeah, he was really nice. He really young, no? Really young, really young. He looked like he was only around maybe 15 years old. Mm. But he was trying to bring us for a ride in his horse cart. That would have very been very allergic to horses. I'm sorry, yeah. but uh, oh, by the way, one bottle of water was uh, five thousand uh, Indonesian rupees, and uh, that's like I want to say it's around thirty cents, thirty euro cents for a bottle of water. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. This area here in Kota Tua seems to be a lot of museums. Like I was saying, we have the Mandiri Museum here, which seems to be very large, and. Yeah. Um, due to the influence obviously of the Dutch that were here for such a long time. The British were here, believe it or not, but they were only here for a few years. Was it three uh, years or It was something? like three to five years or something. That was like how long they were here. So there's not much influence from the British, but... Uh, the, the houses here are very reminiscent of the Dutch architecture, huh? Like this uh, True, some of it really does. Uh, looks very European. A lot of around Kota Tua. You see the uh, the European influence around the the old town of Jakarta. Jakarta used to be known as Batavia, I believe, which oh. is uh, really interesting. I'm not too sure what Batavia actually means. Does it mean anything in German? Batavia. Batavia. No. So guys, we made it to Taman Fatahila, this beautiful square here in Kota Tua. There's plenty of museums around and we just sat and listened to some live music from the amazing locals here. I'm not too sure what sort of a band they were, but it was a collection of amazing local musicians. Sat and listened to them, jammed out for around 40 minutes. And this is where you can find the Cafe Batavia which is a pretty famous cafe. We are so blown away by how friendly, kind, and heartwarming the people are here. This is literally our very first day walking around. So many people have stopped us already to say hi, to take selfies, to even just ask us where we're from. So nice, very, very good feeling about this area. And uh, Kota Tua in general, it is pretty touristic area we've seen quite a lot of tourists hello, hello. 
<laughs> There's plenty of tourism going on, but people are How so friendly. How cute are the people here? Sorry to interrupt, but they're <clears throat> so cute, so beautiful. It's crazy. We have just been doing nothing but smiling since arriving into Jakarta. And uh, I'll tell you what, guys, you're very, very lucky to be from such an incredible place as this. Indonesia is really impressing us so far. And have a look at just how gorgeous this area is here. Lots of people are renting these very colorful, beautiful bikes. Well, this one here is actually totally white, but uh, that's our friend actually. <laughs> but um, there's loads of incredible buildings uh, to check out. Loads of museums. Museum Wayang. Not too sure now what that's all about, but you do have plenty of stuff. Hello. And um, yeah, I think we're going to be hanging out around here for quite some time. It seems to be a really good vibe. And I think we're going to go and try possibly find some food for us to try out as well. Some local uh, Jakarta style food. Uh, with just so much different things that we have to tick off. And it's only early days. It's literally our first day here. All of them. Photo, yeah. He takes a picture. I take it. I don't want to, I'm not going to be in it. <laughs> Ready? Nice. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. Terima kasih banyak. Sampai jumpa. Sampai jumpa. I'm learning. I'm learning. <laughs> ah, amazing people. Yes. So cool. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. Naomi. Naomi is a celebrity. Why, why, why me, not you? I don't know. I am the celebrity. I feel, I feel so left out right now. Oh, you're gonna be included, I'm sure. It's just because we have predominantly been meeting women. I think if there's men, we're, we're gonna meet men and they are gonna take a picture with you. I don't you. know. <laughs> For sure. Me and my mustache are all alone. Oh, lonely mustache. Me and my best friend Tashi. Lonely mustache. Uh, lemon honey ice tea. I don't know how much it's gonna be. <laughs> 20? Do I put it? Is this okay? Okay. Terima kasih. Ah, super quick. Do I put it? 20? Do I put it? Terima kasih. You have my straw? Yeah. Perfection. Yeah? Yeah. Good? Really good. You want me to open it? Oh yes, please. I can do it again. This is my favorite part. Hiya! Uh, stab that tea. <laughs> stab the tea. Wow, okay. So, nice refreshing lemon tea just to break up the heat. Oh, it's beautiful. Really good. This like area inside here is very interesting. It's like a collection of different things so like a whole collection of different ice cream vendors there's a cfc here but forget about your kfc they've got cfc some sort of a fried chicken stall we got the st which is like iced tea in indonesia and then a whole bunch of different other ones like korean food chinese food etc etc it sort of looks like this here is an area, like maybe a building that is, hasn't been used in a while and they just filled it up with different food stalls, which is really, really cool and amazing prices as well if you compare it probably to the more touristy um, restaurants that are around the corner. For two iced teas, we paid 20,000 uh, Indonesian rupiah, which is like uh, one euro... Like 120, no? 120, 130, something like that, yeah. yeah. We're still struggling with the conversion rate, but we're getting there slowly, so uh, yep. very affordable and super tasty. Very affordable, yeah, super tasty, very refreshing to break up the day. It is a pretty hot day outside, but not too bad. It's actually manageable. We've been walking around now for a solid maybe two hours and uh, we're feeling very good. I feel like in comparison to we before this, before Jakarta, we were in Borneo and I feel like in comparison to Borneo, temperature wise and humidity wise, it's not so bad. Yeah. It's uh, more, more on the fresh side here. <laughs> yeah. Very, very true. More manageable. Oh I just saw through the open window this beautiful dress with sort of a 
I don't know, it looks a little bit like a dragon mask or something like this and tied it. But I cannot see a price from here. I think we have to go in. Can we go in? Let's go and check it out, yeah. It's so beautiful. I need to have it. Just have a look here at the building. It's like a very old Dutch style building here. The architecture all around the Kota Tua area is very, very special. Just have a look here at this building. Amazing. Yeah, let's go inside and check it out. The house is beautiful. The <laughs> Some really beautiful clothes here. What is that? 70. Yeah. yeah. I think so, yeah. You have size? This up? Yeah, the sun. I'm, I'm a little bit big. Four euro. It says, ba it says Bali on the back though. Oh, I wanted okay. to say Jakarta. <laughs> Naomi is on a shopping spree. Mira. 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 You can try. Ah, Mira. Mav, I'm so sorry. Mav. <laughs> What do you like? I like the white one. Putti. Oh. Putti. Putti. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but it says like Bali on the back. Yeah, we haven't been to Bali. I have never been to Bali, but I like the dress. <laughs> it is a really cool dress. So I just got one beautiful dress. I was uh, looking for sort of these like flowy long dresses that are a little bit wider because it's more comfortable, especially in the humidity and the heat. So I just thought this is the perfect choice. I mean, it says Bali on the back. I've never been to Bali and I don't <laughs> think that we will. We will. I don't, I'm not sure if we're going to go to Bali this year, this time around, uh, maybe. But uh, for now, it's Java. It's all the way Java. So, yeah, yeah but I'm going to walk around with a Bali dress, even though I haven't been there. But it's OK. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and uh, we paid 70. 70,000, so that's uh, 4 euro 16, something like that for a dress. That's not bad. Yeah. We didn't we didn't try to haggle the price. We just were like, we'll pay it. First day in Jakarta, try and support people. Let's go and explore more. There's some beautiful buildings this way. Hello. Go and check this place out some more. Um, this whole Kota Tua area is very beautiful. And um, I can't get over the architecture. It's just so, so different. It doesn't even feel like we're in Southeast Asia. It's like, it's a perfect blend of everything in one place. And the people are just so amazing as well. It's very pedest pedestrianized. <laughs> it's very pedestrianized as well, which is um, positively surprising because in a lot of places in Southeast Asia, it's actually difficult to find pedestrianized areas. And uh, this is just so nice just to walk around and not having to worry about the traffic unless there's a scooter coming by, but there's always yeah. a scooter, so that's okay, though. There's always some scooters. Yeah. But um, that's a very good point. A lot of Asia, we've traveled around quite a bit of Asia over the last year anyways, and we found it's, it is difficult to consistently walk around without having to navigate your way through busy streets. But here, it's not really the case. We've been walking and walking and walking for quite some time and it's fantastic great to be able to freely roam a beautiful and historic city like jakarta i have to say well done to the people of jakarta it's incredibly clean here it's crazy it's such a massive sprawling vast city with so many so much going on so many people just have a look at this gorgeous it looks like there is a way to access these like thingies what are they called walkways 
the little walkways on the water sometimes, but right now it's blocked off, unfortunately. It would be so cool to walk over the water. How clean is this area? Yeah, it's very nice. It's amazing. And this house is so, so beautiful. I keep taking pictures of it because I cannot believe how beautiful the house is. Wow. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Is that like a hotel or something? I don't know. It looks very close from the outside. I, oh. don't, I don't know. Very beautiful. Maybe, maybe a nightclub or something? Could be. Maybe a nightclub or something. It is... Uh, wow. I cannot imagine being inside there. It seems to be like totally taken over by that, by all of the flowers and the growth. It's crazy, very, very there, beautiful. On the, on the first floor balcony, it looks like there there is some seating arrangements. So maybe, uh, maybe a restaurant or a bar or <laughs> something. I don't know. But from right now, it looks closed from the outside. So I don't know. Nasi goreng ayam for 20,000, so uh, fried rice with chicken oh. for 20,000. Nice. Good, no? Yeah. And you can get some roti, you can get all of the baksos and the mis as well, mi ayam and so on. And they have juice. I Whoa, like juice. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. Let's should we, give it a try, yeah. Here? So we are at Canteen Kotatua, just kind of on Canteen? the Kotatua. back corner of the big of square. The square yeah currently trying to figure out how it works here with the ordering but in a lot of Southeast Asia they sort of just give you a pen and a paper and then you just write down your order which makes it very very easy if you have any language difficulties I personally I think I'm gonna go with the what, what are you gonna get do you want rice or noodles I think I might get a some sort of a me dish like a me I am or something you want the me I am bakso or me I am polos I don't know why don't we get a me I am bakso yes so me I am and I'm gonna go with the nasi goreng ayam because I feel like fried rice right now. Nasi goreng ayam, also one. And then, what would you like to drink? So they have all of the juices. Yeah. Apple juice, melon juice, pear juice, strawberry, orange, all of the juices. Uh, tea, they also have sweet tea, te manis, sweet tea. But I don't, I don't think it's ice. I think it might be hot. Ice lemon tea. Ice lemon tea. Yep, I'm going with one of those. Let's do it. So me, I am Bakso Nasi Goreng I am and Dua S lemon tea. Sweet. Totally. <laughs> <laughs> Very interesting in I just found out that uh, soy sauce in Indonesia is called ketchup yeah. so now we have to reconsider everything that we know ketchup is not ketchup it's soy sauce and chili sauce well, chili sauce is chili sauce right and <laughs> um, this is your me I am bakso and I think you also have a sambal here if you want oh I've got some sambal it looks, uh, smells really nice a nice spicy red sambal oh nice oh. Terima kasih. Terima kasih. Oh, look at these colorful. It looks amazing. What are these? Are these like prawn uh, crab, crab cakes? Prawn crackers. Oh. Very nice. Why are they yeah. colorful? Why are they pink? I don't know. Pink and yellow. Very interesting. Oh. Yeah. You want some of them? I'm gonna, I'm gonna taste, I'm gonna taste mine first, and then I'm gonna try some sambal. You can give yours a try as well. Wow. So colorful. <laughs> Unexpected color, unexpectedly colorful. Oh yes! Oh, it's steaming hot. Wow! It looks so nice. It's so hot that it's like. <laughs> oh, I'm scared that it's too hot for me. Mm. Oh my God! This is amazing. Not spicy at all, though. I think I will have to add some of that uh, sambal on top. Maybe some chili sauce. Yeah, give me that chili. Yeah, better. Yeah. Now it's nice. Good amount of spiciness in there. <laughs> Beautiful prawn crackers. Oh. <laughs> prawn cracker ASMR in the house. No, very nice. And it's also only 20,000 20, uh, Indonesian rupiah, so one euro 30. Yeah. I want to say big portion for that money. Really good. And this bakso, me, I am bakso, so noodles, chicken, bakso, the bakso, I believe, is the meatballs here. Very excited to try this. Let's do this. Grab myself my cutlery. And 
let's just dive right in. So I've got a bunch of leafy greens, lots and lots of these amazing looking noodles. We've got what looks to be some sort of maybe crispy onions, maybe some shallots on top. And uh, here you have the amazing juicy tender chicken. And then you also have the bakso meatballs as well in there. This looks incredible, very, very juicy and very appetizing. So I'm going to just go right in with some of that I am, the noodles. Give it a try. Oh my god, that's amazing. The texture of the noodles, a little bit chewy, but still cooked to perfection. The really juicy chicken is crazy flavorful. It's sitting in that amazing soup broth, the soto broth. It really just adds a different level of flavor. I don't, I'm not even sure what sort of a flavor I'm getting off that chicken, but it's not spicy, very juicy, and incredibly packed full of flavor. I'll give one of these meatballs here a try too. Put the whole one in, why not? Oh my God, yeah, fantastic. And this bowl, just look at it. It's literally packed full of nutrients, everything that you could need. You've got protein, you've got some greens, you've got more protein here. And then you have some amazing, beautiful, juicy carbohydrates. Nobody's mad at carbohydrates. This is the perfect dish right here. Wow, okay, fantastic. First day and first impression of Jakarta. We went to Jakarta Kota station and went to try and figure out a bus. And it turns out that you have to get basically like a monthly bus card so i think we're gonna have to sort that out pretty soon because i'm sure it's gonna save us a lot of money but we ended up jumping into a grab taxi and had an incredible conversation with a jakarta local uh, really amazing guy he sort of showed us everything that we needed to know all along the way on that grab journey uh, it was really something special yeah we got a little bit of a private tour included of jakarta with the must-see places it was so so beautiful um and also first impressions of jakarta my god it's a massive city but it's a very beautiful city and we are yeah. both so so excited to be exploring around here for the foreseeable future and yeah. also seeing the rest of java then um, after jakarta yes we have a massive adventure ahead of us guys so definitely hit that subscribe button if you haven't already we're going to be spending a very long time exploring around indonesia as much as we can starting point of all this amazing adventure is right here in jakarta meeting some amazing people. We're going to be spending roughly around a month exploring Jakarta, so plenty of content coming your way. And mm -hmm. both of us now are ready to go to bed. It has been a hot day, but it has been a very, very amazing day too. Also, if you have any tips and tricks around Jakarta or Java mm -hmm. in general, please let us know on Instagram or in the comments below, because we love uh, getting some tips off of locals so that we can get around a little bit easier and maybe see the must see places and eat the must fe must eat food and so yeah. on difficult sentence it's late uh, we need to go to bed <laughs> <laughs> hey guys please let us know down in the comments everything that we need to see everything we need to do everything we need to eat we are trying to make as much plans as we can we never usually plan our trips so we literally just show up in a country <laughs> very little research and then just jump into the deep end and try and talk to as many people as we can so if you are in and around jakarta and you have some information that you want to share drop it down below mm -hmm. but for now guys my name is luke my name is naomi we are the two mad explorers and this is your reminder to keep exploring we'll see you guys in the next indonesian adventure Terima kasih banyak for watching. Terima kasih banyak. Bye bye. Bye bye.